ever wondered why we've cows on this planet? We have cows for a very good reason. Baby cows. Ever wonder what baby cows are called? Well, you are about to find out. This is my information of farm animals. In Irish, it's Amvahe Firm. This is the information about farm animals book. This is what a farm looks like. We're going to start at number one, Iverahain. Cows on vo. This is a male cow, that's a female, and this is a baby. <clears throat> So here is the information about it. Well, I can read this information now. Ready? Then let's go. Cows are animals with long legs, long tails, four hooves and two horns. Female cows have udders with four teeth that produce fresh milk. The milk can be sold in bottles and cartons and can be made into butter, cheese, yogurt, ice cream and other dairy products. Male cows or bulls are mostly aggressive so everyone must be careful when bulls are approaching. Bulls are killed for their meat. It's called beef. It can be made into burgers, steaks and beef fillets. Cows have one calf each year. Calves are baby cows. When they're born, their coats are wet. So their mother licks them clean. A newborn calf drinks its mum's milk. But they soon start to eat plants and grow to be a cow or a bull. Okay. Cows produce milk in their udders. People milk cows for making dairy products like cheese, yogurt, butter, ice cream and chocolate. The milk is also sold for drinking and put into cartons or bottles. And here are all the dairy products. Bulls are killed for their meat. It's called beef. The guts, liver, flesh and bones are made into legs, steaks, butters and fillets. That's all the meat we get from them. When a calf is ready to be born, the mother cow pushes it out of her vagina. Cow pushes it out of her vagina. Yeah. The vagina is where the calf develops. The cow pushes the calf until it comes out. When the calf comes out of the vagina, it's wet and weak, so it lays down for a while until its legs feel stronger. Then the, cow is, the calf is licked clean. To begin with, the calf only drinks milk from the cow's teats. When it gets bigger, it soon begins to eat plants. This is a drawing of a bull. You can see it's got its horns and it's very big. So this is just the drawing of a bull. The drawing is pretty good, everybody says. Now this is a real bull. Look at its haunts. Imagine that running into you. This is a bull right here. In Irish it's called Tariff. Bulls show they're angry by stomping. 
and mooing loudly. The moo is so loud it can scare humans. So people have to kill the bull without making it notice. It takes a lot of work. It's not easy, you know. So that's the male cow. Now this is a female cow. The drawing of a female cow. She looks more aggressive. I mean, not more aggressive, less aggressive. As you can see, she has her udders with the four teeth. Now this is the drawing. Let's see the real life version. There we go. A real cow. And here are the udders. With the four teeth where the milk comes from. That's where baby cows drink from too. Some cows have horns. Some do not have horns. Have you noticed that cows sometimes get piercings in their ears? This tag shows which barn it's from. It's just like the piercing humans get when they're getting earrings. Except this is a cow's version. It's a good job we have cows on this planet. And here's the writing of it. Cow. And it's Mana. Female. The Irish for male is fur. Dairy cows are really useful animals. It's a good job we have cows. And here we have the baby cow, a calf. It looks to me that cow is, that little baby calf is female because it has spots and it's got a piercing in its ear. And you can see its nose is slightly pink and its fur is softer. So here's calf. And it's Lao in Irish. And the gender is baby. Bobbian. Or Lanuf. These calves drink milk from the teats until they're all grown up. And that is all about cows. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. I'm a fluent Irish speaker. Just like everybody says. See you later. See you next time.